Four ministers have skipped a crucial cabinet meeting called by the West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee. Um, Rojib Banerjee, the Forest Minister, is, on a, is considered uh, on the rebel list. He's not there. He wasn't there for the meeting. Uh, Chandranath Sinha, the Fisheries Minister, said he's busy. Ch uh, busy apparently with the Chief Minister's visit to Bolpur on the 20, 28th of December, which is why he said he couldn't attend. And two ministers from North Bengal, apparently missing, reportedly unwell, Gautam Deb and Rabindranath Ghosh, but they are reportedly uh, not feeling too well, which is why they couldn't attend. Monadipa Banerjee joins us. Monadipa at a stage like this, uh, Mamta Banerjee would want every single minister to be present. Now, some of those ministers say that they're actually preparing for a forthcoming rally of hers. So what's the truth in the matter? Well, uh, quite a lot of interesting things came out of the cabinet meeting and after, uh, starting with the fact that Rajiv Banerjee was indeed missing. And Rajiv Banerjee, all eyes are on him because he has in the past uh, made certain critical comments about his party. He has openly spoken about uh, the culture of sycophancy and yes-manship in the party. And uh, he has been in talks with senior Trinamool leader Partho Chatterjee uh, about his uh, problems with the party. But even after two or three rounds of talks, that he didn't show up for cabinet is being viewed as significant by political watchers and analysts. The other three, Chandranath Sinha, as you mentioned, he sort of excused himself. He was busy in Bolpur, where Mamta Banerjee is headed on the 28th. The other two are up in North Bengal. They could have joined by video conference, perhaps, but again, uh, one of them has been unwell, so, you know, uh, there is not much talk about them. Rajiv Banerjee certainly coming in for discussion, especially on a day that Shubhendra Adhikari, the person, the minister who exited the Trinamool Congress the other day, he held his first BJP rally uh, in Badwan with Dilip Ghosh. A couple of other points that I must make about Mamta Banerjee's press conference in which he didn't take any questions. Mamta Banerjee said, Mr. Amit Shah, the Union Home Minister, owes her a treat. A treat, she said, I love Gujarati food and I'd love some dokla and I'd love some other stuff that I really like, food from Gujarat. And why was that? Because she presented a whole lot of facts and figures which completely disputed Amit Shah's facts and figures about Bengal which he presented on Sunday. For instance, industrial production, Amit Shah said Bengal was 16th. Right. Banerjee said Bengal was 4th. Amit Shah said no investment in Bengal. Mamta Banerjee says 22,000 crores. So that conversation ended with Mamta Banerjee asking Amit Shah for a treat. Uh, what might the Home Minister have planned? We don't know. But again, there is also talk that he might return to Kolkata on the 12th of January to observe Swami Vivekananda's birth anniversary. All right, Mujiba, thanks very much for joining us. West Bengal politics clearly heating up. Missing ministers or ministers doing, apparently preparing for Mamta Banerjee's rallies, no one really knows right now, but she'd be concerned.